Hey everyone, welcome to Prosperous Life Finance where I help educate you in becoming a better trader and investor. So in this video, we're going to be taking a look at the Golden Nugget Online Gaming IPO. Before we start, I would love to thank all of you first for all the support which I have been receiving. My goal with this channel is to create a large community of like-minded investors and traders in order to help each other out so that we can all grow together. So with that being said, I would love for you to join the Prosperous Life Investing family and all you gotta do is just give this video a like and also subscribe to watch similar videos to these where I cover different stocks and teach you guys on how to invest and trade so now let's actually go ahead and get into this stock as you guys can see here Tillman Fertitta's Golden Nugget Online Gaming which is GNOG is actually going to go public via a blank check firm which is actually co-owned by the billionaire himself so going down here we see an image of Tillman Fertitta himself and also more information down here so Tillman Fertitta actually plans on taking Golden Nugget Online Gaming public through an SPAC deal now what an SPAC deal is it's essentially a special purpose acquisition company which is simply an easier way for a company to go public compared to a traditional IPO which is an initial public offering offering which takes a lot longer so this special purpose acquisition company is actually going to be landcadia holdings which is a ticker symbol lca on the nasdaq stock exchange and as we can see that when that transaction closes in the third quarter the spac also known as a spac is going to take the golden nugget online name and switch it to the ticker gnog while still remaining listed on the nasdaq stock exchange so as we can see here, Lancadia is going to assume approximately 150 million dollars in gnog liabilities so allotting for the purchase price, the debt repayment, and the fees and expenses that are related to the deal, the combined company will have $80 million on its balance sheet and will have an expected pro forma equity market cap of nearly $700 million when the transaction closes. And here we actually have a statement issued by Lancadia themselves, which says the transaction values the combined company at an anticipated pro forma enterprise value of approximately $745 million or about 6.1 times GNOG's estimated 2021 revenue of $122 million. So as we can see here, this $745 million market cap is going to be quite large for this online gaming company. And we can see how they even compared to their estimated 2021 revenue of about $122 million, which shows this very positive and optimistic company outlook. Before we get into the details of this company, we're gonna go ahead and look at an outline of the positive things about this IPO. So as you can see here, GNOG, which is the first internet gaming company to launch live dealer games in the United States, currently operates in the fast-growing, hyper-competitive New Jersey online casino market. So one of the best things as an investor, which I think is very important for this company, is due to the fact that the firm entered the Garden State in late 2013 and actually turned a profit in the year 2016. So as we can see, in just a short three years, they actually started to gain profit and last year gnog generated net income of 11 million dollars so not only is this a positive sign but this is also huge as there are many ipos which don't even have a single profit yet so the fact that this company actually started turning a profit in about three years does show you about the potential for not only this business but this industry as a whole as the rise of technology gaming has actually made online gaming a lot easier for many individuals and even down here in this article it says that it could be music to the ears of investors because many companies actually are eyeing ipos regardless of the industry struggle to turn profits immediately after going public so the fact that this company has already turned profits before even going public is a very very huge thing and it is one thing that you guys should take a note of so for the last part of this article it says that Lancadia said that GNOG will with pending regulatory approvals enter Michigan and Pennsylvania and as you can see the latter of which is the home to a booming iGaming market in 2021 so not only are they already generating profits but they already have upcoming future plans in order to keep expanding within this gaming market so here we are on the SEC website and we're looking at the investor presentation for this business now this presentation is actually around 50 slides so my job here is to actually make this very simple for you guys and actually go through it myself so that i can just give you guys the key points and the highlights which i think are very important as once again we are all a community and we are just here to help each other grow and expand so let's go ahead and get into this investor presentation starting out they have a very nice highlight of the golden nugget online gaming and as you can see they say they are the leader for the future of online gaming starting here we see how they have a massive 20 billion dollar plus online market opportunity and as you guys know due to this global pandemic the current stay-at-home climate has significantly accelerated consumer adoption of online gaming. 
for any business, I think one of the most important things that is important is actually scale. And as you can see, they have a pandemic resistant and scalable business model with more than 30% profitability margins. So the reason that I like this a lot is due to the fact that it is scalable. Whenever a business model actually has a scalable platform, I think that this is huge due to the fact that not only does it cut costs, but it makes it a lot easier for them to grow and expand, especially since it is online. As we can see here, the Golden Nugget is a household name throughout America with a national database that focuses on profitable gaming customers. They are a well-established leader in New Jersey, which is the largest online gaming market in the United States. And lastly, they have an award-winning management team with a history of successful execution. So this slide right here actually just goes over the detail of the proposed transaction structure. And one of the most important things I want you guys to know is that Lancadia Holdings, which is actually the publicly listed special purpose acquisition company, has a vehicle with over $300 million in cash. So this is going to be a great, great plus once they acquire the Golden Nugget Online Gaming. And like we said earlier, this is going to value golden nugget online gaming at around 745 million dollars so one thing that i really liked about this investor presentation is due to the fact that they had a comparable company benchmark this is important because this gives you an idea of how they are performing relative to similar companies or businesses within the same industry or type of business so as many of you guys are actually aware of DraftKings, DraftKings is essentially a sports betting provider so one of the first very important things that catches my eyes here is the cash flow obviously DraftKings has made lots of investors money and will also continue to do so in the future but one thing to know is that they have a negative cash flow as compared to golden nugget that actually has a positive cash flow now even though people are making lots of money with companies that have a negative cash flow the thing is that they come at a greater risk and while this is my personal opinion i would prefer a company that does have positive cash flow due to the fact that it seems more promising in the near term and also in the future and another key thing which actually catches my eye is the 2019 through the 2024 revenue compounding annual growth rate. As we can see, DraftKings has a 34% and Golden Nugget has a 36%. This calculation is actually very important due to the fact that it is a compounding calculation and actually does tend to grow quicker than many others. So another thing I love is that they give you a quick and simple way to look at this company at a glance. As you can see, they said that Golden Nugget is an internationally recognized brand and company. They have approximately $4 billion in 2019 revenue. So as you can see, the Golden Nugget and Landry's is a diversified restaurant, hospitality, entertainment, and gaming company with over 600 outlets, three hotels, four aquariums, two amusement parks, and five Golden Nugget casinos in Atlantic City, Las Vegas, Laughlin, Lake Charles, and Biloxi. As we can see, they are in 39 states, DC, and Puerto Rico, and actually have 42 international units. As you can see, they are even spread out in large cities that include Atlantic City, Las Vegas, and Lake Charles. Now, one thing I like is that they're also in the diversified restaurant and hospitality entertainment sector. So, no doubt about it, this company is very strategic when it actually comes to their whole business model. As you can see, it says that Golden Nugget slash Landry's has a broad national network of locations. They are strategically located where Americans live, play, and eat. Here they have a map of the United States and all the areas in which they are located. We see here that they have over 3 million Landry Select Club members and they have over 2.5 million Golden Nugget 24K Select members. Not only do these members actually get benefits, but you know, it is an incentive for them to keep going to these places and actually joining the entertainment and restaurants. So as you can see, they are very strategic when it comes to actually expanding this throughout the United States and beyond that. Continuing on, we see how it says that Golden Nugget has a strong history of generating returns. So as you can see, this chart actually shows their return on investment. So for the Biloxi location, they have over a 27% return on investment. For the Las Vegas slash Laughlin location, 17%. For the Lake Charles location, 16%. 15% for Atlantic City and 288% from the Golden Nugget online gaming. So one thing to know is that not only do they have a return on investment in all of the locations, but as you can see, the online location has a huge return on investment with over 288% due to the fact that once again, this is due to the scalable business model. So one of my favorite slides here is once again, the management slide. I put so much emphasis on this due to the fact that I am very sure that all of you want to know where your money is going to in the business and who is actually managing that business and company. Because once again, at the end of the day, you can have the best service, you could have the best business, but if the management team has not proved themselves throughout the years or is an experience within that industry, I do think that there is a large possibility that your investment will not go well. So first and foremost, we're going to go ahead and start with Tillman Fertitta, who is the chairman and CEO of this company. Tillman Fertitta is actually the sole shareholder, chairman, and CEO of Fertitta Entertainment Inc. Now, what they do is they actually own the NBA Houston Rockets, the restaurant conglomerate Landry's, and the Golden Nugget Casinos. And as you can see, he is recognized today as a global leader in the dining, hospitality, entertainment, and gaming industries. So, Tony Fertitta is a very, very overall well rounded individual, and I think is a phenomenal chairman and CEO for this company. To the right of that, we have Thomas Winter, who is the president. As you can see, it says how he joined the Golden Nugget Online Gaming at inception. And a great thing is 
means that he also has experience as he has served as a CEO of a major European online sports betting and gaming operator where he actually grew organically tenfold to 200 million dollars in revenue over three years so i actually think that having someone that actually has knowledge and prior history of working within these industries is a very great plus and as you can see thomas winter does fit that description as the president and to the right of that we have michael harwell who is the chief financial officer and warren stephen who is the vp of product and operations here we have more information about the history of this company cfo and here on the right we're also going to have more information about warren stephen alongside of that we have all of their prior education at the very bottom so overall I do think this is a great management team of very strong leaders and very capable of actually growing and expanding this business at a very large and rapid pace in the future. So here on this slide, we have some more information about their financial performance. Once again, this company was able to become profitable since the year 2016 and delivered significant growth. And they actually had over 40% revenue growth, compounding annual growth rate from the year 2016 through the year 2019. And as you can see on the right, this bar chart actually shows the net revenue in the red for every year. And then in this brown color, we do have the adjusted EBITDA, which is a valuation measure that many investors use before they invest in any company. As we can see, we do see how the revenue has actually grown substantially year over year. And in my opinion, actually going to continue to pick up momentum with this scalable business and very impressive leader, which actually run this company. So another important measure, which I personally look at before investing in any company or business is the actual market opportunity. As we can see here, there is a huge US game opportunity for the Golden Nugget Online Gaming. So as of today, there is around a 13% of an $800 million iGaming market the immediate opportunities as you can see here is around a 12 percent of a billion dollar i gaming market opportunity and lastly their future opportunities is also very very impressive with around a 10 percent of a 22 billion dollar i gaming market at maturity so not only is there currently a very large market opportunity today but in the future this is obviously a billion dollar industry so as we can see they're going to go into an industry which is currently accelerating and is going to accelerate in the future as well so let's start looking at some projected revenues so as you can see in the year 2025 they they do have a projected revenue of over $635 million. And this goes alongside them expecting to enter new markets, which are going to start with a couple of states. And I think are going to start going into many, many more. So now we are going to be taking a look at Lancadia Holdings, which is the ticker symbol LCA, which is the actual stock you're going to invest in in order to invest in the Golden Nugget Online Gaming. So what you see on the screen is the TD Ameritrade Think or Swim trading platform, which is my platform of choice. This blue line that you see right here is the nine day exponential moving average. Down here we have the volume down here we also have the MACD which actually helps us with entry and exit points of a trade and down here we also have the RSI which shows us if the stock is currently overvalued or undervalued so going down here we do see how just a couple of weeks ago the stock was trading at around ten dollars and four cents before it just skyrocketed up to a high of seventeen dollars so with many of these special purpose acquisition companies they do tend to run up a very large amount when they are actually announced so from that high of 17 we do see how it has come down a little bit and now the stock is currently trading at around fourteen dollars and fifteen cents so looking at this 20 day chart we see how the macd has not told us to buy it just yet and how the rsi is actually showing us how this stock is not currently overvalued or undervalued and going up here we do see how as of last week this stock has actually broken this nine day ema and has actually started to use it as a support line in order to continue to slightly go up from around 12 dollars to now 14 dollars here's some information which you can use and could be of help to you so this was a more technical look at lancadia holdings which is going to acquire the golden nugget online gaming and this is the stock that you are going to invest in if you actually want to go ahead and invest into that business so this was both a fundamental and a technical look at the golden nugget online gaming stock now if you guys would like to know my opinion on this stock i do think that it has a great and wonderful future ahead of them due to their management their business model and just their overall structure of how this business is set up and i do think that with the market opportunity that there is available to them that they have lots of opportunity to continue to expand and grow so personally i am thinking about initiating a small position as of now and increasing it over time as we get more news and see how this acquisition goes in the future so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and got lots of valuable information out out of this once again i would highly appreciate it if you would go ahead and like and subscribe to this youtube channel where i plan on continuing to do videos just like these in order to help you guys become better investors and traders and once again create the largest online community of like-minded individuals just like ourselves that love to trade and invest so now i want to go ahead and ask you what do you guys think about this stock in this overall business and just let me know what you think of it let me know if you have initiated positions or actually plan to in the future or just your overall thoughts about this stock and their business so with that being said god bless you all i hope you guys have an amazing day thank you for watching and I'll go ahead and see you guys in the next video.